Alright, last time we got into another battle at sea with Runefaust. Lost the rudder to our ship. Also, I'm pretty sure we blasted a hole in the deck again. Because I just cannot let go of the fact that I can summon a goddamn space laser. Anyway, with our rudderless ship, we are now drifting across the seas. Let's see where we end up. In Chapter 6. Even the words of Runefowl's greatest mage, Mahato, cannot reach Ramla do now. Unaware of this, Jeremy and his friends continue to drift among the waves. Many days pass, until at last the land is spouted, spotted on the horizon. However... As they tried to land, their ship was dashed to bits upon the rocky shore. We cannot keep a ship to save our asses. The first one we had got burnt to the ground. The second one got caught in a tight. The second little boat got caught in a tidal wave and sucked onto a reef. And this third one, its rudder got blasted off. <sighs> Never get on the boat. Where are we? Where is this place? Oh, there's a little girl here. Oh, good! You're better! Your boat ran aground on the shore. You were half dead before, but you seem okay now. What about the others? Is everyone okay? Yeah, they're all resting at HQ. Oh yes, you'd better think Karen. She was the one who found you. Talk to Karen. I'm Karen. I'm the leader of Rudo. Your friends told me all about you. You're searching for the legacy of the gods, right? Do you have any leads? Well, I thought we did, but it turns out we didn't. Not yet. I see. Then you should talk to Kryn, my little sister. She spends all her time reading old records, so she'll probably know something. Alright, what books have we got on the shelf here? History of Rudo, Dragon Gods and Humans, Lawmaking, Self-Sufficiency. Gods and Dragons, History of the Saints of Dragonia, The Origin of Dragons, A Blessed Ray. That's pretty advanced reading there, girl. That is some advanced reading there, girl. This is the land of children! Rudo! Wait, Rudo? So it's the land of heels? <laughs> She's busy right now. She's chasing a chicken. She's chasing a chicken. Well, as long as she doesn't end up choking it. Ew! Hello, good to see you again. I'm a merchant from Rindo. Uh, what a mistake. There are no tools to buy my stuff here. I shouldn't have come. Kids have money. I was worried about leaving the kids on their own, so I stayed behind. Alright, let's, uh... Let's explore here, see what we can get. Alright, let's see. First, let's check and see if there are any new deals. A sniper ring. Guarantees an attack will find its target. Alright, well, let's see about some other weapons here. Uh, steel Sword, Chrome Lance, Battle Axe, Guard Staff, Elven Arrow, and Holy Mace. Alright, so... Guard Staffs... Uh, I can buy one, so... Let me... See who needs it most. Henri's already got Pretty Baller Attack. Oh, and it's only for the advanced anyway, so... I guess I'll give it to Tao. Alright, so... 
Marcel the doll hater. And the and the angel wing. And the mace. I, I really want to get that sniper ring. So, but I, I want, so I'm going to get some money for that, but uh, let's see what I can get from this boy here. Nothing important. Uh, so where's HQ? HQ is down here, okay. Yes, I want to make a withdrawal. How much do I want to... Let's see. Um... Yeah, I was like... Yeah, I think that was enough to buy the sniper ring, so... And then I might have enough to revive at least one person. So... Let's buy the sniper ring. Yep. Uh, who do I want to give it to is the question. I want to give it to somebody who's going to be really reliable on damage. I mean, it being a sniper ring, I'm tempted to give it to one of my bowmasters, but... Give it to Gort. All right. Did I have anybody that I needed to revive? Okay. Well, that's nice. Uh, is there anybody that needs to be promoted? No, because most of my people are already promoted. out from that one. I guess I'll take a look in here. Alright, Blue the Dragon. White. Okay. All of them are gibberish except for the one. Grr. Stop that! It's not playing to Drayton our guest now. Be quiet! A blue hellhound? Who are you? Thank you, Cerberus. It's my pet, you know. Did you want something? Yeah, I was speaking to your sister. She said that you know a lot of stuff from reading old books and records. Yeah, I said a few things. What do you need to know about? Well, the legacy of God? Of the gods? Dark Dragon? Hmm, hang on a sec. There's nothing in here about the legacy of the gods. How can you know that just from closing your eyes? Surely you don't remember what it all says, do you? Eidetic memory! Yeah, 
right! Is that weird? No. No. Well, there was nothing about that, but there was something on Dark Dragon. Want to know more? Sure, why not? The Book of Secrets. There's a link between that and Dark Dragon. We know! The book contains the spell used when Dark Dragon was sealed away. So if anyone had that book, they'd be able to break the seal and get, let the dragon out. That's why the book is guarded by the strongest race on this earth. The Dragon Gods of Draconia. If you want to know more, then you should go to Draconia. Oh, and one more thing. If you do find the Book of Secrets, let me know what else it says in there, okay? Alright. Let's see. Let's do a little more exploring here. See if we can do a little heroic kleptomania somewhere. Kids are all really love Blue. That's why they're so concerned about him. Oi! Hi! Nice to see another stranger in town! By the way, have you seen a guy named Jer called Jeremy? Should we tell him? We should tell him. Jeremy? Actually, that's me. Ah! I see! Ooh, what, what was that? Great! Nice to meet you! I'm Lyle, an assault knight! Dr. Croc of Rindo asked me to come here! Well, well, this is a blast from the past. Lyle, my old buddy. Ah, guns. It's been a while, hasn't it? Do you two know each other? I see you, so you are both... That's right! We are both apprentices of Dr. Croc. But tell me, where have you been all this time? We are supposed to meet in POW. Yeah, well, I... I get it. You still have no sense of direction. <laughs> Sorry. I was headed for your for end, Batol. But somehow I ended up in Alterone. I may get lost all the time, but I'm a crack shot. Let me help you guys out. Lyle joins the Shining Force. So oh God, we're so screwed. All right, then. We'll be waiting at headquarters. If you ever have a flying pest that you need taken care of, just give me a call. I'll bring it down in a flash. Well, okay. Uh, what books are on the bookshelf? 100 menus of the day. 55 remedies for illness. Uh, is there anything that I need to see here? No, there's not. It doesn't look like there is, so I think I'm done with this. Heave ho! Heave ho! Ha! You're just in time. Only one more rock left. Heave ho! Heave ho! My god! Are you part Saiyan? Oh, right. I, I forgot to check on something. Soul Buster. Sword for fighting humans. Causes damage to both the soul and flesh for the elite. It would up my attack... But I think... I think I'm cursed now. <laughs> so... Well, that would slightly decrease Balboroy's attack. And I don't think we're going to be getting any... Uh, Yeah, I don't think we're going to be getting on to any sea battles, so... I think that before I do anything else... Well, there are, there are still some things I need to take a look at here. Like this room here. Found Holy Staff, okay. Found Healing Seed. 
All right, so... Crap. Let's see, who gets... who would get the Holy Staff? Can only be used by Vickers. I do not yet have a Vicar. I mean, if I level up Chris, I'll have a Vicar, but right now I don't. So, what I'm gonna do is... I am going to sell... If I can do it properly. I'm gonna sell... The Merman Buster. I'm gonna keep the Holy Staff. Because I might need it. 2,000 coins, okay. Alright, let's... Since we got that moved, and I'm running around like a chicken with my head cut off, we have a battle on the way to Dragonia. Victory conditions, defeat the Dullahan. Get to Dragonia. If we can be, complete either one of those, we win. If we can do that in 10 turns, we get 7,000 gold coins. Alright, so our formation... I want people that are going to be moving pretty quickly. So... Balbaroy can move pretty quickly. Uh, kind of want to keep May around if for no other reason than range damage. To that end, I am going to bring in Lyle. All right, let's do this. Listen up, all of you. Kane's on a very important mission to Dragonia right now. We can't let that scum into Dragonia. He seems to he seems to have a bad feeling about something. Had an aura of evil from Dragonia. Even if we defeat the enemies here, we must be vigilant. The true enemy may well be waiting for us in Dragonia. Alrighty, so. The good news is that for most of this, our movement speed is not impeded. Because we're on open plains. The bad news is, we've got to contend with some forests and mountains at the end of it, which is going to slow down our movement to a crawl. And we got some artillery, so... Oh, I, for I forgot to check the uh, map there. So aside from the artillery and the uh, Dullahan, we have a High Priest, updated priest, and a Master Mage, so... I should have brought Pal into this, I think. Gonna shoot down Balmoroy for seven. Oh no. 
Oh, Andre. You durable girl. All right, Chris. Heal Henri, please. The sad is, most of the promoted units are actually a lower level than, uh... Yeah, most of the promoted units here are actually a lower level, so... Chris isn't getting much HP at all. A super attack for 21 damage. Alright, Luke! Smack! Oh my god! We are so OP when it comes to the artillery now. <laughs> we are so OP. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to go ahead and laser nuke the artillery here. And Jeremy gains a level. Jeremy is now level 14, HP by 3, MP by 2. Well, now we can just keep charging forward for certain definitions of the word charge. Honestly, it's gonna be, it's probably gonna be Balbaroy, Xylo, and maybe Diane carrying us through the second part. Because as soon as we get into the woods and the mountains, our movement is fucked. Yep, this domain is now Xylos, so... When I, as soon as I get up there, depending on how quickly I can get up there, I may have to focus fire on the Dullahan to get that money. Especially because I'm on turn 5 now. And I'm not even up there. I'm not even close to being there. Go ahead! Bring it on! Five points of damage from the artillery. You know what would have been nice just right about then? A counterattack. Ah, shit. That's just cheap. That's just fucking cheap. I get right up there. I 
I get right up there. Blue is now level 9, HP by 1. I get right up there. Well, of course the mage is going to have magic resistance. Henri gains a level. Henri is now level 5. Defense by 2. Speed by 4. Max HP by 1. I can't get to the Dullahan. I cannot get that money. All because a bunch of master mages and golems came the fuck out of nowhere. Well, at least we know one thing. Gong cannot possibly miss. Or Gort cannot possibly miss. Gort gains a level. Gort is now level 6. Defense by 4. Speed by 5. Max nice HP by 1. Gong! Punch a motherfucker. Boom! Oh, one, two, punch! Gong is now level 9! Defense by 1, speed by 3, max HP by 4, max MP by 4. Slice and dice! Silo gains a level, Silo is now level 7, defense by 3, speed by 1, HP by 3. Shoot the worm! Oh no. I think I need to heal Balbaroy. Two worms, like in dignity. Here in Fair Dragonia, where we lay our scene. Which one will I kill? Which one will I stab? How about this motherfucker? May gains a level. May is now level five. Speed by 5, max HP by 2. healing is in range. No one that needs healing is in range. Frick. Gord is asleep. Well, bye.
Oh god, those golems are doing a lot of damage. Oh god. This makes it even worse! Makes it even worse. Ooh, decisions, decisions. You know what? Three way toast to Thon. Ten! Nine! Nine! And... How can that get in the rain? Well, I found the one person the golems can't defeat in one hit. Oh my god. Well, I think they're resistant to physical attacks. Bye, Henri. <sighs> this is a shit show. Bye, May. All because these freaking mages and the golems pop up out of nowhere. And the golems are resistant to physical damage. The golems are resistant to physical damage. Which means most of my party can't even touch them. The only saving grace is that I got a 46 hit point wonder here. Oh, screw you! Freaking priest. Chris gains a level, finally. Chris is now level 7. Defense by 3. Can I please attack somebody? You know what? This worm's gotta go. I am so done with all of this. Lucas now level 10, max HP by 4, yay. Well, the good news is...
I have Blaze 2 on deck to do a ton of to start knocking some golems around. And killing one. Tao is now level 7, defense by 2, speed by 2, magic resistance by 3. Nine points of damage. That's another dead golem. Oh my god. I'm doing chip damage. I'm doing chip damage at best. If Tau, if Tau goes down, I'm screwed. I'm serious, if Tao goes down, I'm boned. Because, I mean, if Tao goes down, I got nothing that can take out these golems. Oh, fuck you. God damn, High Priest. Okay, so Wild can do some damage to him. Speed by one, max HP by three. Just die already, please. Why are you still alive? If I can kill these two golems, at least then I'll be able to have everyone else focus fire on that one up top. You know what? I'm not even playing now. You got to go, son. I was gonna save that for the Durahan, but no. You had to play rough with me. Defense by four, speed up by one, MP by two. You had to play rough with me.
I, I gotta start doing some damage on the Dura Hand. Two points of damage. I'm not gonna lie, this battle is just straight up demoralizing. Let me guess, the Dura Hand is also going to be resistant to straight damage. Ninth. Blue is now level 11. Attack increases by 3. Defense increases by 1. Okay, now after he attacks, it might he actually have a chance to fucking do something. Bye, Diane. Just go to hell already, please. You know who gives no fucks? Gord. That's who gives no fucks. And now he literally gives no fucks because he can't give fucks when he's dead. Well, at least it's comforting to know that even the Duran can't get a fucking hit in. Place don't look so hot. Uh, don't want to go in there yet. <laughs> I really don't. Because I know what's in that one place. I know what's in that one room. Broadsword, huh? Oh, I guess it wasn't cursed. Okay. Well then, let's see if Balbaroy can equip the, uh... Soulbuster. Yeah, he can. Okay. I need to find the chapel. I need to heal my dudes. I need to bring people back to life. Halberd, huh? I'm pretty sure that the halberd is going to be for my knight characters. So, May's long overdue for a weapon up period. Yep.
Well, I got stuff I got I can sell. Oh, stop it! I'm a cowardly dragon. Leave me alone. Wait a minute. You have to listen to me. We've come from a kingdom called Guardiana. We're fighting against Runefaust. We're not your enemies. We won't do anything. Honest. You mean you're not working for Kane in Runefaust? Kane, you mean you were attacked by Kane? That's right. He attacked us without warning. My grandparents, everyone, they were all slaughtered. I was terrified, and I've been hiding in here. Blue, is this true? While everyone was getting killed, you were just hiding? You worthless coward! K Karen, don't say that. I'm so worried that I can't end after you. And after all this time, you were... I hate you, Blue. Wow, that's a capricious little kid. Eek! That's Karen's voice. <laughs> well, I found a poor, shivering little dragon kid. You want the girl to live. You better open that door. Don't do it! Don't listen to what he says! Don't worry about me! Defend the honor of the dragon gods! Karen! What was a puny little dragon like you gonna do about it? Well, that was a disturbing scream. Thank you, Blue. You finally found your courage. Yeah, I I'm still not sure of myself, but uh, I'm gonna work hard and be strong. If you're not serious about that, Blue, you should go with Jeremy and his friends. Huh? What for? And who are these guys anyway? The Shining Force. They're brave warriors who are fighting against Runefaust. Wow, really? Okay, that settles it. Jeremy, make me a member of your group. Alright, we really could use a dragon god after all. But, are you guys going to be okay without Blue around? You'll be a bit lonely, but I think we'll be okay. Make sure to get stronger if he travels along with you too. So it'll be good for him too. Yeah, you're right. Welcome aboard, Blue. Blue joins the shiny force! He's a scaredy cat little dragon! Alright, I'll be at HQ. I'm ready for a fight. I'm going back to Rudo. I have to tell everyone that Blue finally proved himself. Uh, you're gonna leave out the part where you told him you hated him, right? Another shower cure. I like that. Jeremy, where are you? Show yourself to me. Uh, give me a moment. I, um, still haven't found the church. Okay. <laughs> well, let's revive a bunch of people. It's gonna cost us Buku Bucks. But we gotta do it. Uh, is there anyone we can promote? No. Okay, so nobody's cursed. All right. Well, let's save this and let's take it a little. Let's take a little break, shall we? Yes, we're going to resume. And in the next episode, we are going to take a look at Kane. So uh, we'll take a little break and we'll come back. <laughs>